So, you've been playing Phasmophobia and you've been playing Entanglewood. And you've been dying a lot. Here are the natural hiding spots that will always be on Tanglewood every single time you play. In the boys' room, there is no hiding spot. You might think this might work. It can work off and on, but most of the time if it comes in here, it's going to go to here. It's going to see you. There is nothing in the bathroom that is a natural hiding spot. In the nursery, behind this changing table, is a natural hiding spot. The ghost will come there. The ghost will sometimes patrol to here and will not see you. It will sometimes patrol all the way. If it patrols all the way, it's going to see you. It's going to kill you. But for the most part, it doesn't patrol that, that far down. In the master bedroom, the only hiding spots you have are going to be behind those two doors. There is no natural hiding spot. This used to be a long time ago, but then they made this solid and you can't get past it. In the living room. Behind this bookcase actually does work, except the ghost has to stay on that side of the room. If it goes to there on over, it'll turn around and see you and it will hunt you. In the dining room, behind this spot right here is an excellent hiding spot. This one, I actually, if I get caught a lot, this is my go-to, this one or the nursery, if I can't get to the garage. But the ghost can come here all the way and kill you. Behind the island is a great spot, and it helps you, and it's a good beginner spot to learn how to loop. So basically, looping is what you want to be doing is break line of sight twice and get around and get the ghost on the other side of you and, and make it basically restart its look. Inside the, inside the laundry room is no hiding spot. And here you've technically got three, but really you've only got one good one. So, you can hide here, but if the ghost goes to here, it will come and kill you. But if it stays over there, you're hidden. But why go there if you can go if you can go here? This is the better spot. You can't you don't trap yourself in. Listen for which side the ghost is on, and then go to the and then slide to the other side, and speed up when you need to. Here is also a spot. Because of the gas can, it makes it a little bit worse. If you could, if you could get closer to this red the dread toolbox it would actually be better but you can't but if the ghost patrols here it will kill you best spot in here is definitely the van and you, another great spot to learn how to loop and any and one key thing with looping have surround sound headsets it will definitely help you and will let you know which side the ghost is on then downstairs really the good spots are behind this shelf and behind this shelf Ignore that plaque of wood. Unfortunately, I can't get rid of all of hiding spots, or I would have for this uh, for this for this uh, vid. So just ignore that. But behind here, or behind there, just be aware that sometimes the ghost will come down all the way and will see you. A lot of times, though, it will only go to here, or maybe even to here, and then it will turn around. A spot in the dining room. Key note that if you're if the ghost starts down in the basement. It has a tendency, there must be a glitch or something, but it'll come straight up the steps, come straight around, won't won't look, won't do anything, will just come straight around the corner and kill you and, and will kill you. So if the ghost is in the basement, I would advise not to go there. But if you like this vid, this is going to be a new series I'm going to do for each house. The bigger maps like Maplewood, Prison, Sunny Meadows, High School, uh, Restricted Sunny Meadows, are all actually not restricted sunny meadows are going to be uh broken up into more bite-sized pieces so like sunny meadows will probably be five videos one for each wing and then the center but if you guys like this video this is going to be a new playlist for hiding for natural hiding spots in each house so yeah so it'll be there or there i think it's over here but yeah but i hope you guys like the video and i will talk to you all later bye peace